how to recognize if he likes you and if he does care for you. partner is he just attracted to me does he want just a quick hookup or something how to recognize if he cares a little bit more welcome to black swan relationship academy my name is coach magdalena and i'm your high value coach here on this channel if you haven't liked it yet please like it share it with your friend and subscribe so you're not gonna miss out on the valuable information that myself and the other coaches are sharing here. Six signs that he cares for you more than he says. Or perhaps he's your work colleague and you're just not sure whether he likes you just like a colleague or he have any intentions towards you or maybe he just wants to have a quick hookup or a booty call. It is so confusing ladies, I do understand it. We all have been in the various situations, in a different scenarios where we're just not sure whether this man is attracted to us purely for a physical look or does he want to get to know us a little bit more? If he is attracted to your persona or is he attracted to your breasts? So how to recognize if he likes you slash cares about you? There is a question that a lot of ladies and myself a few years back was asking, what are his intentions? Does he really like me? Or he's just a flirt or maybe I'm too flirtatious? All right, I have today six points for you, my gorgeous swan. So let's hear it. As mentioned before, there are a few details that are determining whether the man is liking you and he wants a little bit more or if he's interested to get to know you or he's looking at you just as a pure hookup. Number one, it's quite obvious one, yet not a lot of people pay attention to that. So, number one, he's signaling that he is single. Back in the days on the Facebook, there was a little icon which was saying in a relationship or a single. And that was making it easy for you to determine whether this person is in a relationship or a single. Now, it's slightly different. It might show up, oh, it's complicated. And then you just don't know whether this person is single or not. Pay attention to your conversations beforehand the dating. I'm not talking about online dating. I'm just talking about normal day-to-day -day, um, situations and scenarios. If the person is telling you, oh my goodness, I have such an amazing plans, but due to the weather, um, it's not going to work out. So I think I'm going to be chilling by myself or going to cinema. How do you think about going to cinema with me? Another scenario, oh, I'm buying a new car and I need to go and pick it up. What are you doing this day? Would you fancy driving with me to pick it up? This is the small teeny tiny detail that he's letting you know that he is single and available. Because if you would want to go and pick up his car, don't you think that he would take his girlfriend or trusted friend? No, he wants to get to know you and he wants to get closer to you. Hence, he's inviting you to go with him. He's gently letting you know that he is single and available. Also, he's checking your position, whether you're interested or perhaps no. In that case, he won't be pushing it farther because he wouldn't want to get burned. Pay attention if the man is giving you a little insight into their calendar and checking for your availability. That is a signaling. Number two, not so obvious compliments. Fair enough, we're all here. 
about how beautiful we are, how beautiful our eyes are, um, how sexy we are. Those are the obvious compliments which majority of time every single man can give you. Every single man can tell you how beautiful you are and you probably hear it a lot because yes, my ladies, we are gorgeous. Yes, we are. And you are gorgeous. So always take the compliment from the man and say, thank you. However, men who are attracted to you, they're not gonna stop only on the physical comments. They will comment your personality. They will comment how amazing you're dealt with the task or how amazing mother you are. We're looking for the men who can cherish you, who can make you feel like a queen, like you are a precious, precious person. And that's what you are. You are a precious gem. For any single man, he would love to be with you. If you still struggle with your confidence, if you still struggle with how to date, how to heal, Chengi have a message for you. I created the Black Swan Nation because I wanted women from all over the world to be able to access on the point help with their dating and relationship needs. We have the expertise of our world-class coaches, including myself, supporting you ladies through your dating journey to have access to live coaching without having to blow the bank. This, of course, we can only take a certain amount of ladies and support a certain amount of ladies, but I want you to know that you are currently welcome to the Black Swan Nation. You may end up on a waiting list or you may get lucky and be able to get right into the Black Swan Nation where we provide more insight, where we discuss more personal stories that will be of use to you. In the Black Swan Nation, there are no holds barred. It is unfiltered. It is only for the brave because in the Black Swan Nation, we give you the raw truth. So all you have to do is follow the link on this video and we will see you on the other side. Welcome back. As previously mentioned, we're talking about non-obvious compliments. The man who is attracted to you, who likes you, and who cares about you, he will pay attention to the smallest details, the way how you flip a page in a book, how you react to the certain things, how are you laughing, and he will be looking into the characteristic of a potential wife material. Number three, he's not disappearing. If the man cares about you, he's not going to be pushing for a physical contact too fast. He will want to get to know you because you're a high value woman, you're a precious gem and he wouldn't want to hurt you or lose you. Of course, any man would love to be with you and take you to the bedroom. That's not even a mystery, but a man who truly cherish you He's gonna respect your boundaries. However, we're gonna have a situation when the man is clearly only about the physical. And if we'll get to that point, when you feel comfortable with him and you're gonna decide to move the relationship to the next level, and he's disappearing, that is a big red flag because he just had this tension, this physical tension that he just fulfilled and then he's not interested anymore. That tells you that this man, he wanted just to have a quick hookup. A man who is respectful, who is cherishing your boundaries and cherishing you as a person and want to get to know you, he will wait whenever you are ready. So please stay away from the guys who are trying to get you into bed and sleep with you. Number four, he's not worried about the opinions of others. We all know that a man has his crew, he has his mates, his friends, his best mates, uh, people that he will steal the horses with. And we know that they are sharing, maybe not as we girls talking about a man, but yes, they still do talk about girls' relationships. Maybe not on the same level as we do, but trust me, they still gonna mention something. We live in the days that every single warm gesture towards the female is called by his friends being a simp. Being a simp, simping, you probably heard about it, maybe not. It's one of the phrases that is running through the web for the past few years. 
Simp was used to name a man who originally was attracted and obsessed with a woman and was so desperate for her attention especially on the website, on Instagram, or maybe on a YouTube perhaps, and he will slide to her DMs. I'll be so obsessed knowing that he doesn't have a chance. Sadly, the simp is overly used these days and it's used by his mates just for a little sign of affection or warmness towards a female that he's interested in. Men do live under the pressure of their friends. What I will say, how are they going to react, whether they're going to laugh at me or not. But truly high value man, he doesn't care about that. He doesn't care what his mates have to say. He will respect that, but he's not going to shy away from treating you to a nice dinner or treating you to a beautiful walk by the sunset just to feed the swans. So if you are approached by a man who is confident and who have his head straight and is not bothered by the lousy comments of his mates, he's a gold and keep him. Number five, ladies, he wants to make you laugh. Sense of humor is very attractive and quite sexy. And every single man would want to do the best to make you laugh. I find it very attractive if a man is making me laugh and frankly it's very boring if the man cannot make me laugh. Obviously I'm not gonna be too cruel about it, but if the man doesn't want to make me laugh, does, is he even interested in me? Hmm. In the beginning of getting to know each other, the man is not gonna be only speaking with you, oh, how was your day, what you were up to, but he will always try to make you feel comfortable and make you laugh. That makes him feel very masculine. And yes, I got it, she is laughing, she really likes me. And that is determined for him. Oh my gosh, yeah, she do likes me. Because we as a lady, sometimes our signaling is not clear. So for him, it's a clarification. Yes, she laughs at my jokes and me that she is open to get to know me as well. Also, he's checking you out, whether you guys are on the same wavelength, whether you have similar humor to him, or maybe you are very serious and you cannot take a joke. It is really important for him to determine that in order to make future steps. It might start from something innocent, like receiving a funny meme, and mind you, if you are browsing Instagram on your break from work and you go through it and you see some funny things, what do you think? Oh my gosh, yeah, I want to share it with my brother or with my best friend or someone who is close to you. So you see, that's the way he's putting you closer. You are in his close circle. So pay attention to the man who is trying to make you laugh. Number six. He has amazing memory. Have you ever been in a situation when you told your best friend about a story and she remembers every single detail of it? No, I don't think so. But a man who is attracted to you, who likes you and who cares about you, he will remember every single detail of that story. Why? Because it's very important for him to get to know you to see what type of person you are, whether you guys are a good match or not. He is always checking you out and checking whether you guys are compatible or not. So pay attention to the man who really listens to you or who have exceptional memory. My ex-boyfriend, frankly, he remembers my outfit from the first day that he ever met me. and. We were friends for another two years and he still remembers that. Why? Because he knew that he likes me from the get-go and he wanted to get to know me. So he was taking slow steps in order to get to know me and to see whether we're compatible or not. And frankly, over the time, he was sure that I was the girl that he really wanted. My gorgeous swans, that's it for today. Please write in comments down below, what are your small little signs that a man likes you, is attracted to you before you guys are dating? And who knows, maybe next time I'll just dig deeper into that. Love you lots, have a fabulous day. Bye.